welcome 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 to the channel that's all about making you the best version of yourself that's right you have stumbled upon soul mighty the place where we don't just bring you the self improvement tips we bring you the choices that'll make your mind body and soul feel like it's been to a retreat now let's face it there are a lot of self improvement stuff which might seem a little awkward or weird to us for example who wants to wake up at 4 am to meditate while standing on their head but fear not dear friends we have combed through the internet books and personal experience to bring you 12 rare self improvement habits that are actually worth trying and don't worry we promise there's no head standing involved <laughs> so grab a notepad a pen and your favorite snack and get ready to learn something about some habits that'll make you a better person and as we say here at soul mighty life is too short to be serious all the time so let's do this coming in at number 12 is talking to yourself now we know what you're thinking isn't that a sign of insanity but here is out folks talking to yourself can actually be a great way to organize your thoughts and work through problems plus who doesn't love having a good conversation with their favorite person themselves at number 11 we have doing nothing yes you heard that right sometimes we get so caught up in being productive that we forget to take a break and just enjoy the moment so right now take a deep breath with us <sighs> relax and let yourself do absolutely nothing for a little while maybe for a few seconds right now and for a few minutes later on nothing just relax and trust us your mind and body will thank you coming in at number 10 is being silly now life can be so serious sometimes and we know that and we often forget to have fun and be silly so let loose and do something silly every once in a while whether it's dancing or making funny faces in the mirror it's guaranteed to put a smile on your face at number 9 we have getting lost now we're not saying you should wander around aimlessly but sometimes it's good to take a different route or explore a new place you never know what you might discover and it can be a great way to get out of your comfort zone coming in at number 8 is practicing gratitude it's easy to focus on the negative aspects of life but taking a moment to appreciate what you have can have a big impact on your mental health so take a few minutes every day to think about what you are grateful for it could be something as simple as warm cup of coffee in the morning or a kind word from a friend at number 7 we have singing in the shower not only is it a great way to start your day but singing has been shown to improve your mood and reduce stress so go grab that shampoo bottle and let it rip coming in at number 6 is listening to your gut we all have that little voice inside of us that tells us when something isn't right so trust your instincts and listen to that voice it could save you a lot of trouble in the long run at number 5 we have being alone it's important to spend time with others but it's also important to spend time alone It can be a great way to recharge your batteries and focus on your own thoughts and feelings. Coming in at number 4 is laughing at yourself. We all make mistakes and do silly things from time to time. So instead of getting embarrassed or upset, learn to laugh at yourself. It's a great way to lighten the mood and not take yourself too seriously. At number 3 we have the habit of trying new things look we get it it's easy to fall into the same old routine day in and day out but where's the excitement in that 
Trying new things can be a breath of fresh air in an otherwise monotonous life. Who knows? You might discover a hidden talent or a new passion that you never knew existed. So challenge yourself to step out of your comfort zone and explore something different. Maybe it's trying a new cuisine, learning a new language, or even skydiving, if you're feeling particularly adventurous. Embrace the unknown and you might just surprise yourself with what you're capable of. Life is short, so why not make it as full of experiences as possible? Coming in at number two is practicing self-care. Now this is something that has been talked about more in recent years, but it's still worth mentioning. Taking care of yourself physically, mentally and emotionally is crucial for overall well-being. So whether it's taking a relaxing bath or saying no to something that's stressing you out, make sure to prioritize self-care. And drum rolls please. We have come to the final point which is the number one less talked about self-improvement habit is being kind to yourself. We are often our own harshest critics, but learning to be kind to ourselves can have a huge impact on our self-esteem and overall happiness. So the next time you make a mistake or have a negative thought, try to approach yourself with kindness and understanding. And there you have it, folks. 12 of the must-know self-improvement habits that can help you become the best version of yourself. Each of these habits has the power to transform your life and help you achieve your goals. But remember, self-improvement is a journey, not a destination. So don't be too hard on yourself if you slip up along the way. Just pick yourself up, dust yourself off and keep moving forward. And before we sign off, we want to remind you to check out our iCard for more great content and tips on self-improvement. Because let's face it, we all need a little help sometimes. And Soulmighty will guide you on your journey to self-discovery and personal growth. Thank you and let life shine bright.